Hey everybody, it is Monday, May 15, 2023. We're going to be doing a card of the day, a focus of intention for the next 24 hours, 24 to 48 hours, excuse me, as directed by spirit, universe, or whatever higher power you call upon. My job is to not push a belief system onto you. My job is to teach you how to believe in yourself. You connect with whatever you want because that is none of my business. Let's get the legalities out of the way. The Almighty Pineapple LLC is trademarked, copyrighted, and registered in three different classifications with the United States Trademark and Patents Office. Any duplication of my content without my permission is subject to legal recourses guided by my legal team with that being said the card oh just like that the card of the day has already flipped out it's coming from the sacred symbols oracle deck by marcella kroll and she's a really great individual go follow her go purchase her books her decks they are amazing we have a couple of them already littles has a, a deck as well so with the card of the day this is not a reading a readings and an intimate discussion between you and a spiritual advisor of your choice like i always say that um i have been away i've been in puerto rico setting up my new place um i do have a space in puerto rico and i have a place here in jersey um, I'm being called back to the homeland, even though I am not from Puerto Rico, my family's from Cuba, but Cuba is a communist country and I do not have the legalities or the legal recommendations and the legal aspect of getting a space in Cuba at this time while it is still being a communist country. So why not go to Puerto Rico? Puerto Rico is home. It's Caribbean islands. All the Caribbean islands are home. Um, and we, uh, we have a strong Taino presence in our bloodline, myself and my husband, my husband was born and raised, um, born in Puerto Rico, raised in New York. And then we've decided to just connect back with our roots. Well, so with that being said, um, the card of the day is gratitude. That's one of the first things I teach my clients and love thyself and connecting to the clairs and spiritually abundant. I will be uh, starting my courses digitally. I'm going to be pre-recording my courses. That way you guys can start purchasing them at a cheaper rate and you can download them you can keep them you can do all the all the damn things if you want and make it a, a beautiful space for you guys to connect with me on a different level if you guys have any suggestions of things that you will like me to teach you in or what is it that my community needs that's the question for me today i am thankful for my community without you there would be no me so thank you thank you thank you and my gratitude today is what does my community need thank you for being here thank you for supporting me thank you for rocking with me thank you for holding it down with me what does my community need so that's what i'm being grateful for today but what are you being grateful for are you grateful that you woke up that you could see that you're here you can have movement of your limbs blood flowing through your veins being in the right state of mind what are you grateful for today if you feel that I've helped you in any way, shape, or form, you can always send a donation to Cash App at Readings by Vida. Or you can also, if you don't want, feel comfortable with Cash App, some people don't, and I understand that because there's been a lot of scams, you can also go to my website, thealmightypineapple.com or vidavaldez.com, V-I-D-A-V-A-L-D-E-S.com, and hit the donations page and send me a donation there if I helped you in any way, shape, or form, whether in the past, present, or even the future to come with the cards of the day, my snippets, any of my content, I am here to serve. But what is my community? And gratitude says a deep honoring is present. Give and feel great thanks now for whatever blessings have arrived or en route to you now. Drawing this card invites you to share your devotion or to outwardly express gratitude to someone or something for its presence in your life. Meditate and create a gratitude list for all that you're thankful for in your life. And the symbol is a devotional candle. Candles have long been used to light a room, a path, or even a cake. They're often used in magical rituals, memorials, and to honor sacred passages in life. I do have a couple events going on soon. We're going to be having the May community reading. We're going to be having the mojo envelopes coming up, back up, as well as the pre-order transformation pendant, lots of love pendant, double A pendant coming up. My soaps are on sale. A lot of my products are on sale because we're having new formulations come out. So stock up on those old soaps because we have new scents and new formulations coming up. I also we're going to be doing another past life regression this month so stay tuned make sure you hit subscribe uh follow my youtube channel follow my uh, subscribe to my page on my website as well under the contact page and as always if anyone's dming you saying that they're me trying to sell any product or service please block and report i do not scam you can purchase all my products and services on my website thealmightypineapple.com or vidavaldez.com thank you for fucking with me and again i want to ask my community thank you thank you thank you without you there would be no me so i'm grateful for all of you and like i said what is my community let me know in the comments below i really would like to know your your under um your feedback what does my community need for me and what can i do for you guys on a more consistent basis i love you and thank you for being here